Hello and welcome to Black Rune. Thank you for tuning in today. We are doing another loot gaming unboxing now. Uh, I missed last month's. So it literally arrived a week ago. Um, and I recorded it and I was about to edit it a couple of nights back and uh, this bad boy came through the door. So um, actually, I'll tell you what, we'll bundle him into the same one. I got last month's theme was actually a Road Rage. Uh, we've got a few little funky things here. Actually, got this here, this is a twisted metal uh, ice cream scooper. Yeah, I can get the fucking thing open. We also got Rocket League Flash Ball, a uh, car windscreen, and I've just knocked everything over. Uh, we've got, yeah, a car windscreen Mario Kart, and uh, yeah, actually, that was it, uh, along with a t shirt. Nothing particularly exciting in there, it wasn't the best loot box in the world, but at least. You know what it was, and then we'll just quickly pick that thing up. Fell. Come back. Then back where they belong. But this month, once again, I have absolutely fuck all idea what's in it. So uh, I'm going to quickly find my scissors. It's a fairly hefty box, actually. Uh, it's not very heavy. It's just rather big. It's a big box. I'm just gonna quickly cut towards myself. Uh, probably not the smartest idea for work this evening. <laughs> Wicked. There's that. Sorry. Done that. Oh, oh crap. It, it seems packed. It seems packed. Right, we're going to do our usual and just go completely blind. So, the first item on the agenda is actually a top, which I did see was quite funky colours. Uh, it appears to be a double fine t-shirt smells a bit odd uh, there we go it's just a standard generic black t-shirt by the looks of it and that is oh fuck, what is that that's that jack black one. Oh shit bollocks I can't remember the name of that now I'm just gonna quickly have a look oh Brutal Legend! That's the one. I never played it. Um, I heard it was actually a very good game. And currently, with the Steam sale on it's one pound and nine pence. So, uh, I might be quite interested just to see what that's like. Uh, see whether it fits in. But yeah, that T-shirt is a. Uh, uh, it's very loud. Yeah, it's very loud. Whether I wear that, I don't know. But still, it's something. With a. Uh, throw that back there and we'll move straight on to the next one actually I'm looking at the brutal legend screenshots popping up on my screen at the moment and actually it looks pretty fun I think I just saw Ozzy Osbourne there which is just like yeah yeah okay now the next uh, I'm actually gonna pick the small item on the edge here which is uh, battle toads uh, red it's metallic it's probably it feels like a key ring or something Or a belt buckle. It's a belt buckle for battle toads. That's actually really quite nice. You'll get some uh, small shots of it soon. But... Holy crap. That is a heavy piece, but that is also loot crate exclusive. It's very well made. It does feel very well made, actually. It's a big chunk of metal there as well. Um, all right, I've got to admit, I've never played Battletoads, so I never really knew what they were. But that, that's pretty funky. If you're into that sort of thing, it is a loot, game, uh, loot crate exclusive as well, which is always, always good. Just uh, poke him back in the box and put him back there. Uh, the box is quite nice, actually. I do quite like that. But uh, not really, once again, my thing. I don't really wear that many belts, and the ones I do are pretty shite. Because I'm too lazy to buy a proper one. All right, so next, uh, that's the badge. So I'm gonna stuff that in that corner there and grab this fairly long. Oh, oh! I've been playing a lot of Fallout Shelter recently, and we've just got a Fallout 4 AER9 laser rifle. Official uh, Bethesda exclusive to loot. Exclusive to loot gaming. Now that's new. Don't normally get any loot gaming exclusives of such. Let's just uh, crack open that box. 
and uh, see what we have inside. Oh, wow. Oh, that is cool. Comes with its own stand and everything. Uh -huh. Uh -huh -huh -huh. And there we have it. A Fallout 4 laser rifle. That's really funky, actually. That's quite nice. If you're the, if you're a huge fan of Fallout, I do enjoy Fallout. That is quite nice. Uh, it's fairly large and a bit. I want to say fiddly. It's a bit. It's not got much strength to it. If you know what I mean. It doesn't really feel like it's got all of that strength. And the stand is a little bit funky. So I have to have another look at that. But uh, that yeah, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, nonetheless. So uh, we're going to dive into the next one. We have a big box here. Um, and I think this forecloses everything. So we have here a League of Legends Heimdinger. Heimdinger? Heimdinger? Uh, I'm not sure what it is. It's a collect collectible figure made in China. Uh, Riot game. So it's a League of Legends. It's a really nice box, actually. Um, it's number 20. Uh, he looks like a panda or something like some little fluffy teddy bear thing oh he smells nice he comes with a little card on the top there as well so slide it all out he's even wrapped bloody hell this is like some serious shit okay so if i pull this apart and we pull out this card we have here to verify your item please touch your nfc enabled device to this card or visit merch.riotgames.com this is a card of authenticity. That is really cool. So you can get legit shit. That is wow. Okay, let's, let's pop him out. Now I've never really actually played League of Legends. I think I played for a couple of days and that really did it for me. I'm not really much of a MOBA man. Okay, now he comes out, he's He's heavy, I'll give him that. He's fairly well modelled, I like his glasses. Some of the stuff's a little flimsy. But, uh... Yeah, I mean, he's, he's okay. I have no sort I have no sort of connection to it. I thought his head was uh, wobbly for a second there, but yeah, he's he's cool. Once again, I don't play um, League of Legends, so it's all a little over my head. But he comes in really cool packaging, and I'm sure there's a sort of collector's value to that, especially with the Riot card there as well, um, which will certainly be interesting to see what that does. We certify the authenticity of this item as official Riot game merchandise, and we verify it, yada yada yada. I don't quite know what it does after that, but that is... It's cool. It's cool. I still have no idea what uh, the actual thing could be, so I'm just going to pop that over his head and uh, pack him back in that box for the moment. I'll leave him on the side and I'll get some photos and videos of them in a bit and dump that there. Right, and finally, finally wherever I put the badge, it is here. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that is cool. It is a Nuka Cola badge, and it is for uh, da -da -ba, Champion. Okay, so this is June 2017 box. We actually received it in June. I'm currently recording on July, in July. But uh, holy shit, that is that's really cool. I do like that pin. That is really nice. It's even got a little plastic cover, so you can pull that off. I like that. I think that badge is probably one of my favourites so far, actually. So we'll dump that. We'll uh, pop that on my lap and have a look at the box. Oh, look at that! It's a Fallout box! Oh, I will, I will just pop that down there and then I'll do that. But we have the poster here, which is... Uh, it looks like the Fallout... Yes, it looks like the Fallout Red Rocket uh, from the promotional images of Fallout 4. Which is really cool. I really do like that. A very nice picture. Um, and uh, 
those so you could get different Nuka Cola bottle caps. You could get a, a variety of them. There's unique ones, I think. That's quite funky. And the League of, Legend, League of Legends champion figure, you could get a variety of them as well by the looks of it. Yeah, you'll get one of 15 champions. And that's cool, and there's four variants to the new Coca-Cola bottle caps as well. And uh, this month's uh, pit, uh, was a Pip Boy Epic Drop. Two lucky winners get the Pip Boy Deluxe Bluetooth Edition Epic Drop. That's cool. That's cool. Uh, estimated value of $350. That ain't bad. I'd like to have $350 to uh, drop on something like that, you know. But uh, nonetheless, uh, I like the poster. I like the cool outfit. Uh, the rest of it, I really have no sort of connection with, which is a bit of a shame, but it's cool. It's not a bad box. In fact, I did say I was going to turn said box inside out because I like, I like this sort of military gear. Look at that. That is cool. I really like that. Even got a little handle on the top there. 1,000 cartridges of 7.62mm. A165 is cool. It's got all the little sort of uh, markings on there. It says 1500 there, but it says 1000 there. Oh, that might be a cap. It's a good fit of that. But that's cool. That's cool. I like that. I like the little boxes. I have a. I literally have all my loot crates under my desk, which is uh, a bit of a pain in the ass to say the least. But still, there we go. That has been this month's loot crate champion it's yeah it's not bad um i doubt i'll do anything with the league of legends so ebay with it probably but uh the rest of it yeah pretty cool um yeah i don't quite know what to say uh t-shirt's cool the little fallout thing there is cool so yeah i think you really have to be kind of interested in League of Legends to really get the full worth out of this box, if you know what I mean. We've got a couple of Fallout bits and stuff like that, but that League of Legends one is a big box that takes a big chunk of it, and I'm sure that has a very big collector's value among them. So, uh, yeah, not bad. Not bad. Might be worth something. I don't quite know. But uh, thank you very much, guys. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more, please tune in next time for more. Hopefully, it arrives on time next time. Um, but I will also include. Uh, some video of my previous unboxing uh, which was supposed to have gone out this week but uh, yeah I'll stick it out for you you can see what I got in the box photos of uh, a video of the t-shirts and all that sort of shit but thank you very much guys I'll see you on the next one bye